Are you packing me that suitcase? I have packed you that suitcase. Robbie says you'll have a bit of supper ready for you when you get here, if you like. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you, tell him. And Gillian says you're welcome to stop the night, if you don't fancy turning round and driving straight back. OK. Great, why not? Why don't I pop over with a bits and pieces? You? Well, it'll save you time and... Best thing you can do if you want to be useful is stay here with the boys. Cos I might stay over there. Why? But just tonight. Why not? But it really is all about you, isn't it? That's... that's just... When I get back, we really do need to work out what's what and who's is what and all the rest of it. Boys! I'm off over to Halifax. Yeah, he's come round. He's regained consciousness. Oh. Yeah, he's going to be fine. Well, we hope. But... I know. Oh. So, we're not doing anything tonight, then? Well, we left it up in the air, didn't we? So is that all right? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, of course. I think I was more upset when I heard about Alan than I was when my dad died. God, that's an awful thing to say, except he had dementia, my dad, so in some ways yes. it was yeah. a relief. How's Kate? Yeah, she's, uh, she's, um... What? Oh, it's all, um... Like everybody suddenly knows, and I didn't want it to be like that. I mean, I don't think we know what we are yet exactly. However, you've slept with John. I was pissed. It was my birthday. I felt sorry for him for being such a twat. He looks so pathetic. Oh, you really have slept with John. I'm pleased you told me. It won't happen again. No, no, I don't think you can have him. I don't want him. No, he's got good income. I don't care. <laughs> I think him brain dead, low life trailer trash, aren't you? Yeah. But that's because I'm a snotty bitch. Oh. I can't help thinking how different things would have been now if he hadn't... Oh, oh well, Celia. you don't need to think about that now, do you? Mm -hmm. I think the world of you two... You both know that, don't you? Oh. Where's little, um... What's his name with a broken leg? Paul? She slept with John. She just told me that night, my birthday, her birthday, when he was over here shooting his mouth off. You and Alan set off over to Harrogate. I was propping Judith up in casualty, and they ended up in bed together. She told me because she feels bad about it and she was drunk and she wishes it hadn't happened, but... I don't know, how do people do that? Why is everything so casual and meaningless? And... I just, sorry, I just think I'm a little bit shocked, that's all. I'm, don't say anything. No, 